Hey yo, Momo here, and welcome to the second episode of Another Code 2 Memories. In the last episode, we did all the introductory stuff, um, and Jessica, our aunt, went off somewhere to find all that. So, um, we're actually going to be looking for him. Um, and we talked to the captain last time, so we're going to go this way. Okay, and as I said last time, everything can be done with the stylus. Um, so even moving around, I'm doing with the stylus, <laughs> which is pretty neat. Okay, I can't see anyone. Where are they? Okay, so let's go see if we can find something over here. Oh, <laughs> it's a circle that goes to the same place, right? Okay. So every time this uh, magnifying glass uh, pops up like this, means there's something to examine. Okay, so let's see if we can examine. I can see the boat we were on. The tree is huge. The branches, the branches seem to fill the sky. Um, I might not be examining everything in such detail as this, maybe, um, but it's, it is quite important in this game to kind of look at every nook and cranny, um, but I might not narrate everything that it's, that I examine, so. There's a stone bridge to the island. Um, and what is this? The sea is calm, right. So. Let's go over... Oh! There's a big rock. <laughs> the ground is barren. Right. Okay, let's go here. There's the... There is the bridge to the island. Jessica must have gone this way. Jessica. You said you would come right back. Did you manage to find that? Uh, oh, Alg! <laughs> that came from the other side. It sounded like that was Jessica's voice. What happened? I'd better go and find her. What's that? Drop it, bridges up. Jessica, I've got to get to the other side fast. I'm so very sorry if you hear. <laughs> There's a dude cutting grass. Sorry about that. <laughs> Um, someone decided to cut some grass right now, um, for some reason. Okay, so we have to get to the other side of the bridge. So let's look at this. The machine is rusted. What's that handle for? Let's look. This handle... Maybe if I... We spin it right round, baby, round, round. We direct it, baby, right round, round, round. Yes, the drop bridge is open. Uh, it's down. <laughs> I can get to the other side. Right. I I just want to point out how much I love this music. It's so very calming. Jessica. Where are you, Jessica? 
Jessica! Jessica, can you hear me? What should I do? I never would have come here if I had known this would happen. There's a stone marker. Something is written on it. Property of the Edward family. Edward. The name sounds familiar. Oh yeah. That's the rich family that used to own this island. Oops. <laughs> I meant to go back. Right. this way. What's this? What's that at the fork? It's a broken sign. I wonder what it said. What's at the bottom of the post? There are some broken pieces of white wood everywhere. What did the sign say? Puzzle time! Okay, so we can say this goes here. This go no, doesn't. Uh, oh, maybe it does. Um, this goes here. And this goes right here. The Edwards Mansion. I fixed it! I didn't even get any splinters. Let me take a look at it. The Edwards Mansion. The Edwards Mansion. Well, that looks like a mansion. Looks like a mansion on the left over there. But what does that logo on the right side of the sign mean? Hmm, very curious. Um. Let's see the gate. The gate is locked. There's a metal box on the post. What's this? There are buttons on the plate. I wonder what would happen if I pushed them. Huh? Why can't I push them? Ah! The lock is missing a gear. Right, oh, we have to get a gear. Okay, let's go the other way. It's been so long since I played this game, so I can't remember if there are secrets that are missing. Ha! Huh? The path is blocked by all these rocks. Now what? Um, go the other way. Huh? That's weird. It's so quiet all of a sudden. Jessica! Can you hear me? Mm -hmm. It's too quiet. Creepy. Oh. That looks like a gravestone. I must be in a cemetery. Creeps. It's a broken gravestone. Huh. That's an old gravestone. Thomas Edward. There's a name on the grave. Thomas Edward. 1912 to 1948. Thomas Edward. The 
captain's story was true. Let's take a picture. Wait. And the other gravestone? That's an old gravestone. Henry Edward. Whose grave is this? Henry Edward. 1910 to 1948. Henry Edward. He's one of the Edward family. Let's take a picture of that too. Great. It is really eerie. <laughs> Okay, let's go forth. Now oh, this is curious. A large stone slab blocks the way. It looks heavy, but if I can move it, I can get out. Heave, heave, heave the hole. Eh, come on. I did it! It moved! Now I can leave the cemetery. Hey, what's this? It looks like the old other side of the stone has an engraving on it. D. Hmm. I wonder what it means. Who's there? get a good voice for this um <clears throat> what was that what are you doing here answer me what's going on where's that voice coming from i don't understand show yourself who's talking I am uh -huh. Uh. <laughs> nope, nope, ghost. Ah, <laughs> where are you going? Please don't go. Stay and talk to me. Ah! Right. Ghost! I don't understand. I can see right through you. I... I think... Are you... What's your name? A Ashley? A Ashley? That's a peculiar name. I mean... Ashley, Ashley Misuki Robbins. Ashley, please, someone help me. Ashley, open your eyes. What? Why? Open your eyes and look at me. Huh? Why? Can you see me? Uh, yes. Are you sure? Yes, I can see you. You're right there. You can see me? This is just wonderful. Huh? <laughs> the, the ghost is laughing. How terrifying. Why, why are you laughing? I'm laughing because I'm happy. What? What? I've been waiting all these years, waiting so long, for someone like you. So I'm really bad at little boy ex <laughs> ex um, what's it called? Expressions. Okay. <clears throat> someone like me? What do you mean by that? I've been waiting for someone who can see me. I don't understand. You 
can see me, right? Of course I can. I can. You're standing right there. Why are you so surprised? Because I'm not human. I mean, not anymore. Oh, can it be true? I'm D. D. Oh no. What have I done? That must have been his gravestone I moved. Why? Why me? Why does this have to happen to me? I haven't found dad or Jessica. And now this waking a ghost? What else could happen today? What should I do? That's not true. What? That's not my grave. My body isn't there. Uh, my body isn't in there. What are you talking about? Did you hear me thinking? I've been here for a long time. Nobody ever noticed me. I've been alone for a very long time. Alone? Yes. Completely alone. But... Maybe... Maybe it's just because no one lives here anymore. N no, of course you wouldn't understand. Understand what? There have been some visitors to this island. But none of them could see me. Until today. I... See. Do you understand what this means? People with clouded minds can only see what's in front of them. I don't understand. Your heart and mind are pure. What are you saying? You can still believe in people. That's why you can see me. Hmm. You must be the one. The one to help me reclaim my memories. Reclaiming memories? Reclaim your memories? What What do you mean by that? Ashley, I have no memories. That's impossible. How can you not have any memories? I can't remember anything about my life. Who I was. Why I died. I remember nothing. That's why I wander around here. That's why I can't move on. How long have you been here? I think around 57 years. 57 years? Why are you so surprised? Maybe I shouldn't be, but I just can't believe it. 57 years, I'd be an old lady by then. You've been wandering alone for that long? Yes. That's just terrible. Yes. Which is why I need to get my memories back. I need to remember. I understand. I feel the same way. How? I have something I want to remember, but I can't. Ashley, you can't remember anything. Not even the tiniest sliver of memory from your life? Well, there's one thing. I remember... Oh, I remember. <laughs> but he remembers. What do you remember? Something calling me D and also this mark on my chest the mark on your chest it's the last thing I saw something burned into my memory the moment I died go on if I could just remember what it was I could probably remember why I died I need to know why I died. I need to move on from here. D. I 
can't help thinking about what the captain said just a little while ago. He told me not to be thinking about death at my age. But poor D has been thinking of little else all this time. Ashley, please help me get my memories back. But please help me uncover what happened on this island. Help me. Help me to remember what to do. I want to help Dee, but I have to help. Uh, I have to find Jessica and Dad. The captain said he's leaving the island before sunset. And Ashley, what? You're going to see your dad? Who's Jessica? Did you hear me thinking again? I came here to meet my dad. I'd been told that he was dead. Your father is dead? So I got mad at my aunt Jessica. Then we got separated. I'm not following your story. I'm sorry, so much happened. I just really want to see him. Your father? Yes. It's been so long since I've seen him. I need to find him. It's why I came here, so... I'm sorry, but I can't help you get your memories back. Father? Father? Ha! Huh. D, what's wrong? Uh, father? Don't come in here. Mm -hmm. What's the matter, D? Ashley? Oh, D just disappeared. Where did he go? D? No! My ghost friend is gone. Hmm. Right. Okay, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. Um <laughs> We we have a ghost friend now, I think. But he disappeared, so in the next episode I think we're going to have to find him again. And also Jessica and our dad. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a like down below, comment on something. Um, <laughs> I don't have a question of the day or something like that, but do do tell me in the comments below if you enjoyed the series. And yeah, <laughs> so until next time, stay happy.